Hi Mike. I hope you are great buddy. Absolutely, you have to be focused on your nutrition. Like whatever diet you have explained me that you are having your breakfast around like 7 a.m. where you have been eating three egg whites and two whole eggs. Then eating that in the morning you are getting you are providing to your body a very good amount of proteins like you getting clean proteins you are good providing good fats good fats and along with eggs you are taking like 70 grams of oats it's absolutely perfect perfect for muscle building right now you are in the program i see i have seen you like you have amazing physique that you have transformed your body in such a way now but now you have to focus on growing your muscles and for growing that it's absolutely perfect the posture you have the conditioning you have right now is absolutely perfect what you have to focus more on that you have to increase your protein intake in this i want to highlight one thing that when i said you have to increase your protein intake it doesn't mean that you have to eat a lot of protein your body need to digest those protein as well if you take too much protein what will happen you you will create problem for your kidney <coughs> sorry so what will happen that you will create problem for your kidney because your your body is not adapt to that situation you have to gradually increase your protein intake and you have to make your body compatible for that so here i would say that in the morning you just try to consume 20 grams of protein just 20 grams of protein i would not recommend you to take any supplement i generally don't like to, to recommend any of my clients to take any supplements but if they can if if they want they can but here i focus more on the natural stuffs so i would suggest you to take 20 grams of protein in morning then you have to give a good break of 2.2 2 and a half hours and after that you have to take another meal so what do you have to do you have you have to take at least 6 to 7 meals throughout the day after 3 hours intervals like give a 3 hours break or 2 and a half hours break and take the other meal so this is how you have to plan your meals and in every meal you just try to take 20 grams of protein and that way what will happen like if you measure your protein intake throughout the day you are getting almost 30 grams or almost what i would say in each meal you are getting 20 grams of protein if you divide it with the six you're getting 120 grams of protein the conditioning you have it's absolutely perfect the type of training you are doing is absolutely perfect for that so initially right now you are starting i don't recommend you to go and take heavy protein but I want to suggest you to take and balance your protein intake between 120 to 130 grams. That would be the sufficient for you. And for the workout, because the kind of workout you have been doing, the kind of muscle training, the kind of power training, and the kind of cardio you are doing is absolutely great. As I told you that you have to do your cardio twice, like twice a week, not more than. Where in those two days you have to focus more on your cardio rather than focusing on your muscles. So you have to do it. two days cardio dedicatedly and and the next six and next four days of the week what you have to do you have to do power training i mean with the power training is that you should not go heavy i would suggest you to increase the repetition because you don't want to be bulky okay you want a well aesthetic and curved look where you want to just highlight all the muscles all the curves you have so what i would suggest that you have to go on high repetitions rather than increasing the weight that will what will will do that it will increase the strength of the muscles and it will highlight the curves of your body so this is what i would suggest you to focus more on and and this is what and if it's possible for you if you feel that that you need to do a more cardio two days is not enough for me so in that in that situation i would suggest that do one thing that you can do a cardio if you think that you want to do more cardio so what you can do what you can do like you can do one thing that you can do a half an hours or 20 minutes of cardio in the morning and like later in the evening or maybe whatever time you have for your workout and that time you just dedicatedly focus on your workout on your power training don't combine cardio and workout simultaneously because if you combine both the things what will happen you will ultimately damaging your muscles which i don't recommend you to do that so you have to focus that you have to make your cardio session separate and power training separate in this way you will focus one portion of your body and try to keep your body in one condition if you want to follow the cardio follow the weight loss or 
just cutting the calories of your body so that session is totally dedicated for that but if you want to build muscles if you want to pump your muscle you want to lift weight so for that you have to say but segment a particular session for your power training again i'm telling you you have to make these two things separately workout just do at a separate time a power training do at a separate time if you do it this way it will help you a lot so i hope you have got your answer and it's really nice talking to you because you have just it's it's absolutely amazing to have a call like this where we can just to see your progress the kind of progress you have been the kind of question is you are having it's absolutely great so i hope you have got the advice and i really whenever you feel like connecting you want to know any information please drop that in the community and i'll try to answer and or if we have a time we can have a video call like this we are having right now so see you bye bye